As it is quickly approaching the festive season, many people will be attending parties, family gatherings and work functions, and you may even be opening the odd bottle of wine. Recent years have seen metal and sometimes even plastic corks replacing the old traditional wooden corks that we were all used to. If you are like me, you may ask yourself, which is better for the environment? So we hope to answer that question today. The first thing to note is that traditional wooden corks are not just any old wood. They are flexible, which enables them to pop out of a champagne bottle. They are traditionally harvested from cork forests in the Mediterranean and in particular Spain and Portugal. It is very interesting that traditional cork harvesting is renewable. This means that the tree is generally not cut down. Cork is harvested from trees in a way which keeps the tree alive to grow more cork which is then harvested again some years later, which really removes any guilt from drinkers. Another benefit of traditional cork is that cork forests are the native habitat of endangered animals, such as the Iberian lynx, the Iber Iberian wolf, the Spanish imperial eagle, and the Barbary stag. By using traditional corks, we help preserve these native habitats. So, if that is the positive, what is the negative? And if you ever watch our videos, you'll know there's usually a negative. Corks are quite difficult to recycle, i.e. they are generally not a recycling service or system available, as the corks themselves are quite small. However, my view is that they are wood, and so will naturally decay anyway. So this is by no means that bad, certainly much better than with plastic, etc. Corks will decay in a commercial composting facility, so many cities will take them in their green bins for grass clipping. They will not break down in your garden compost, but if you chip them, they can make a good mulch for your garden. I personally believe wood and wood products is nearly always better than plastic or metal, as it is non-toxic and has no negative impact on wildlife. I hope this makes you feel better about yourself the morning after a big party if you've had one or two too many wines. For lots more recycling info, visit us at wastearth.com.au and like and subscribe below.